shit. It's on the move, it's on the move, it's on the move! Okay. Scream. Scream again. <laughs> Ready, scream! It's mud? Yeah. I think it's dirt. Where are you going with it? Wherever you want. <laughs> That's crazy. It doesn't really hold that much. I can do that part, babe. Yeah. I can do it. So this is amazing. I actually didn't even know there was actually a sidewalk back here. James said there was, but I didn't believe him because I had never seen it. So we decided to hire a landscaping company instead of doing it ourselves. They're called Top Notch Landscapes out of Roseburg. I'll link their Facebook below if you guys are interested in hiring them. But they're gonna be the ones taking care of our yard for us because uh, we don't have the time. And frankly, I just didn't really want to do it but it's looking good. Yeah, so they're done with the entire front, front and back and trimming everything. And they're gonna start on the inside and this side tomorrow. But I don't know, I feel like this back corner is gonna take them a while too. Dumpster number two is here. I forgot to film the other day, but all we were doing was cleaning up the pile from the gardener and I started to clean out that shed that was left from the previous owners and there was, <laughs> God, the biggest spider I have ever seen in there. So we threw some bug bombs in there, but I'm honestly scared to go back in there and take anything out. Gardeners are gonna be here today while I'm at work. Looks like they started on that little section right there. And then another one of them is over there in the corner cutting berry bushes. It's freaking crazy started to cut this stuff right here and the yard's looking better though we're almost there still gotta wait on james to level the house which is kind of hard because he works non-stop so but we're making progress we're getting there so it's looking good there's a little visual for you that's what we have going on and they made it to the back of the fence right there, which I'm telling you is like another 10 foot back from where the bushes are. There's like a little hole now. It's freaking crazy. I don't even get it. Ah! So I guess this tree is in between both of our yards, so they're not really too sure exactly what to do with it, but they said they trimmed what they could on our side. And then there it is, all done. And they're gonna trim that one too, I asked them to, even though it's on their side. shut down. Go get a freaking chain then!
Do you need a permit to do this? <laughs> True. You better move when he's done. I f he's so mad. Watch it not even do anything. Take number two with some rope because they didn't have chain at the store. <laughs> I have to stand this far away because I don't want to die. I'm scared. <laughs> oh my! Take number three. Fun fact, none of us know how to tie like fancy knots. Neither of us were boy or girl scouts. <sighs> this is stupid. We just need the damn shed down for the wood to smash down the dumpster. Oh, something's happening. Take number four. <laughs> oh. Yay! <laughs> Finally, we have big boom. We did it! After the fourth try. So now we just got like half of a shed missing. And we have enough screws to build a whole other house. <laughs> oh, my shadow's in the way. Didn't even know it was there. Wow, that is a lot. Now we gotta clean this up and put it in the dumpster, though. It's hot as heck out here! <laughs> That is glue. Are you filming this now? Yes. Oh my god. It's so glued to the floor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yum. <Yeah. laughs> I don't even know what to do. Look at that carpet. Oh my god. It's so we almost got the carpet out. And it's disgusting. And we had to end up ripping off all the siding because they put the siding on over top of the carpet. But it was disgusting anyway. So ripped all that out. We're on the last little piece. And then it's going outside. Our second dumpster got hauled off today, and then we're gonna be on to the third one. So, this is fun. How stinky is the carpet? Very. <laughs> Hence the masks. And we don't know what kind of diseases it's carrying. All of them. All of them. <laughs> Stuff that was eradicated years ago lives in here. We found a penny from 1976 stuck down in the crack over there, so. That was pretty cool. And some weird writing on the wall. What did it say, babe? Something about May 7th. Oh, called mom, didn't remember her. Okay. Invited mom over May 7th. D listened and remembered something May 7th. Don't know what the hell that means, but it was underneath the side paneling. Freaking weird. Is it? Why didn't you finish the carpet? <laughs> Come on, let's get the carpet outside so it smells a little better in here. 
hopefully. Honey, I am taking the carpet out, so watch out. Oh, God. We blew it all down. I don't know. Now we got to work on taking all the freaking wood off the ground, too. And this hideous Ugh. fake tile. I shamed Gabe's head, too. He told me to. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and it's free! Freaking gross! No, not okay. The smell isn't okay either, like at all. No, no, it smells like something bad. Something really bad. Well, we'll check in in a Look little bit. Look how freaking disgusting that is. Oh, never mind. Look how disgusting it is. Ugh. The plywood underneath of it too. That's the next move. Just taking that out and this out. And then there will be this original wood, hopefully, underneath of it all. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? On to ripping up the plywood. I wonder what that's made out of. I don't know. Hopefully it's not asbestos. <laughs> <laughs> they used to make everything out of asbestos. Not dropping over there. Not lifting up the baby. Oh god. I'm gonna have to close the door. Yeah, you're gonna have to close the door. Hold on. Carpet, and then we had vinyl, vinyl, and then plywood. plywood, and now it looks like maybe more Ho vinyl. Hopefully, more vinyl. <laughs> Hopefully, not diseases. Hopefully, not cancer. Uh, was, it, was it mesothelioma? Let me open the door. Yeah, that kid didn't like her on the shovel. <laughs> I freaking killed it. <laughs> well, James is almost done getting the plywood up, kind of. I'm ripping freaking nails out of the ground. Are you done now? It's horrible. I wish. Not yet, Elizabeth. We got like a whole year to go! I know I look crazy. You don't need to tell me. So we just got that little piece of plywood. We decided we're gonna stop scraping everything up at this and just leave this. And then James has this little tiny section over here. I have picked out every single nail from this corner all the way. And I just got this little tiny spot over here. And this was like ridiculous. There was so stuck into the ground. But since we got the carpet out of the house, it smells so much better in here, which is what I was hoping for. So I'm pretty happy. Thank God it was that freaking disgusting carpet and it feels a lot more open and nice in here and can't wait to get the rest of the flooring up and actually make some progress. There's our pile of flooring out there. It's disgusting. Gross! Carpet stinks. 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 Brody! What are you doing? Well, we're done for today. We ripped off all of the flooring and all the nails. Ripped out all the wood paneling that was back there. All the wood from the floor over here, over there. We have some boards we need to replace underneath that are rotted. So that'll be next. We decided we're gonna not paint these after all. We're just gonna 
rip them all out. We don't like it. <laughs> Our mask's up there. We're just gonna rip it all out. I think we might get rid of the cupboards too. We're just gonna go all out with the kitchen. We know it's gonna cost a lot, but it's, might as well do it right the first time, right? So we're gonna do that. And then here's our ridiculous pile. We've gotta freaking get another dumpster now. That's all the stuff we ripped out today. <sighs> all right, until next time.